So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in Windows PowerShell. You're gonna right click on it and then click on Run as Administrator. And then click on Yes. And then once you're on this, you're gonna copy and paste the command, which will be down below in the description. We're just gonna highlight this and then do Control C on your keyboard to copy it. And then come to PowerShell and then do Control V on your keyboard to paste it. And then click on Enter again. Wait for this to load. It will take a while. Wait for this to load. As I said, it's gonna take a while. It's still loading. So wait for this to load. And then once the blinking cursor appears, it means that it's done. So if you see anything like that's red over here, it's fine, just ignore it. Just wait for the blinking cursor to appear. Now it's done. And now for the second step, you're gonna head over to search and type in registry editor. Click on it. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you can follow everything that I'll be doing up here. So first you're gonna expand HK local machine. Then you're gonna expand system. Now you're gonna click on the setup folder. Click on this. And then when you click on the setup folder, this will now appear on the right side. Now you're gonna find upgrade. You wanna right click on upgrade and then click on delete and then click on yes. You want to delete the upgrade value. And now you just wanna restart your computer and then the phone should be fixed. 